Greetings to you all. Welcome to class 7th, unit 1, supplementary. Alice in Wonderland. Alice was beginning to get very tired of sitting by her sister on the bank and of having nothing to do. Once or twice, she had peeped into the book her sister was reading, but it had no pictures or conversations, thought Alice. Suddenly, a white rabbit with pink eyes ran close by her, then disappeared down a rabbit's hole. Filled with curiosity, she ran to the rabbit's hole and peeped through the entrance. The hole dropped suddenly and Alice fell. Suddenly, she came upon a little three-legged table with a tiny golden key. When she looked around again, she had not noticed before and behind. It was a little door about 15 inches high. She tried the little golden key in the lock. She opened the door and saw a beautiful garden through it, but she could not reach it as she was too big. Subsequently, Alice found a green bottle that said, Drink me. Alice took the bottle, had a drunk, and to strain until she was no bigger than a doll. She opened the door and quickly ran through it. She exclaimed, She was no bigger than the insects that crawl on these floors. She's shouts startled the white rabbit who ran past her again. Mistaking her for its maid, he ordered it to go its cottage and fetch its clothes and fan. Alice was confused and thought that she would find some way to go out. As she was going out, she saw a piece of chocolate cake that was kept on a table and written on that eat me alice so hungry immediately alice ate the cake she began to groan longer than that house alice managed to pick up rabbit's fan immediately she shrank and made her small again Soon, she saw a green caterpillar dressed in a pink jacket. He was sitting on the top of a large mushroom, smoking a bubble pipe. Alice ate a piece of the mushroom. Mochihe and the hatter were having tea at it. A dormouse was sitting between them, fast asleep and the other two were using it as a cushion, resting their elbows on it and talking over its head. Alice thought that it was uncomfortable for the dormers. When they saw Alice coming, they shouted that no room, no room, but Alice said indignantly, there is plenty of room. Suddenly, she found herself in the middle of a field where the Queen of Hearts was playing croquet. The Queen of Hearts noticed Alice and asked her whether Alice had overplayed croquet. Yes, Alice timidly answered. Yes, she had never used a flamingo or a, a hedgehog. The queen ordered to play with her and the queen thought that if did not win, Alice would take head. Court was done in season, announced the white rabbit and asked Alice to come to stand. Alice asked what was going on. Queen accused her that she was guilty of stealing the delicious hot shaped tarts. And then you must be punished, ailed the queen. 
Alice replied that she did not have the slightest idea what she was talking about. Alice was only playing croquet. Alice felt that someone touched her shoulder to wake up and she had been sleeping for too long, said her sister softly, that she had a strange dream. She was reading again, mumbled Alice. As she stretched, Alice saw a little white rabbit with pink eyes scurry behind a tree. Dear students, shall we recall? In the story, main character is Alice and sub-characters are White Rabbit, Mad Hatter, Mod Hare, Doma, Queen of Hearts. What is the theme of the story? Yes, Childhood Innocence, Wonderland, Imagination and Fantasy Adventures. Thank you students.